Rolling, twisting, even braiding to add texture. It's a lot of planning, a lot of preparations. It's a labor of love for Ronaldo or Roy Cruz, as he's affectionately known. When I saw this online, oh, I need to try this contest. The 14-year-old contest invites contestants to create exquisite wedding gowns out of toilet paper. This is Roy's fifth year entering. So when I was in the Philippines, I used to make gowns uh, made up of shells, corn like dry flowers. Using a lot of hard work, determination, and most importantly, patience, Roy is able to transform this into this. I really love doing designing, I really love doing creations, and I love making flowers. But that love was halted last year. His mom was admitted into the hospital in April, just a month after he started making plans for his gown. We always go to the hospital and mom is dying. So I need to stop doing this because, you know, the feeling, the emotions, the heart's ache. Thanks to his nephew, Roy picked back up where he left off. A week after his mom's funeral, his nephew died in a car crash. My nephew and my my mother, I'm getting emotional, my mother, uh, they are my inspiration for my last gown. And this year, as Roy twists, rolls, and glues toilet paper flowers to his designs, he feels at peace. I know she's happy wherever she is now, I know. And on June 20th, people will be looking up at Roy's design when it's modeled on the runway at the renowned Kleinfeld Bridal Boutique in New York City. Roy's designs have made the top 10 before, but this year, he's hoping it takes the cake. I'm Kim Kung, News 3.